guys, I hope you're all well. Welcome back to my Minimalizing My Life series. Um, today, I've realized that I only did, I've only done two videos so far, and I've done, did one last week and one the week before my kitchen and our family bathroom. But I really wanna just kind of get loads more done because even though I feel really good after I've done one, the, like the rest of the house isn't done, so I don't get that like, ah, oh, lovely feeling. So this morning, I'm gonna try and get through a few more rooms. Jasper's in the living room, so is Jensen. Jensen's doing app. Jasper is just watching his iPad. We're gonna go out for the afternoon, so yeah, I thought I would crack on. I'm gonna start with this room. This is our utility room. I'll show it to you properly in a minute. The washing machine is on, so I don't know how much you're gonna hear me, but um, yeah, I'll start with this one. Okay, so here it is. It's got a bit of an annoying door. It's like a consultina door, is that what you call it? I'm not sure. Um, it's very, very small, so there isn't really much to do in here. Um, but you've got toilet, little steps, the boys can get on the toilet, and toilet brush, obviously. Um, got the side here. This picture is our wedding seating plan, um, which I do want to put up on the wall and probably move this. I need to figure out what I'm going to do. This is a poo spray. You spray it in your toilet, and then if you have a poo, it doesn't smell. That I would really recommend. Um, and then I've got the surface here. I bought this to go under the cupboard, like under the sink cupboard here to organise the toiletries. Side unit here, some clothes, obviously my camera and phone, and then laundry basket, the one mop that I'm keeping. <laughs> um, if you saw my kitchen, you'll know what I mean, because I had three, and the ironing board. But there's not really kind of a great deal of stuff in here, so it shouldn't take me too long. And then this is just the cupboard under here, which I really want to organize. Um, so that'll be like the main part of the video. Okay, so I've taken the heart down because I only put it there because there was a hook. As you can see, they had something here before and it kind of fits this perfectly. So when Pete gets home, I'm going to ask him to put this up on the wall there in the center. And then this heart, I think I'm gonna put by the front door. I'm not sure if I wanna keep this plant in here. It's like a fake one. I think I'm gonna put this somewhere else. And then this one from the kitchen, I'm gonna put here. This hoover, I think the handheld part I'm gonna keep in the cupboard under the sink. This one can stand up over here next to the mop. And then these clothes, these are trousers that wear my nephews. So I'm gonna put these, I've got storage, like stuff of the boys that they don't fit into yet. So I'm gonna put these upstairs. And then a plug can go in the cupboard under the sink as well. There's nothing I can really do about this bit because there's nowhere else I can put these things. So we've just got the um, long part of the hoover, the mop and the ironing board and then the laundry basket. So I'm just gonna have to leave those as they are. And now I'm gonna tackle this cupboard here. It's not the best angle and it's really, really noisy. So this probably isn't the best video at all, but yeah, I'm just gonna get everything out and then decide what I can get rid of. Right, here is everything that was in those cupboards. What I'm gonna try and do is just keep this for laundry stuff and then probably like toilet cleaner because there's no point really having surface cleaners and stuff when my kitchen is just through there and in that cupboard there I keep a load of surface stuff. So here's the stuff I'm keeping. So my iron and the little thing to put the water in and then my peg bag with pegs in. This is the attachment for the Dyson and the handheld Dyson and the plug. Um, this goes on Jasper's little toilet. It's to stop um, the wee going over the edge for little boys with willies. These are for my Henry Hoover, which I keep upstairs, but I haven't really got anywhere to keep the bags upstairs. Two of these little in-system things, I'm gonna put one in now and put one of these upstairs, so they're not actually gonna go back in the cupboard. And then this is my laundry stuff, so I've just got some vanish stain remover. This is what I put the baby's socks in and the boy's socks in, just so they don't get lost and stuck like around the edge of the washing machine. Color catches, always, always use color catches. This is the laundry liquid and fabric conditioner that we use because both boys have really, really sensitive skin. And then because this isn't scented, if I'm just washing like Pete's shirts or just mine and his clothes, I put some of these in, unstoppable scent boosters just to make our stuff smell a bit fresh. And then this is just toilet stuff. So foam aroma, you put it in the toilet and it foams up and it smells delicious. Not delicious, that's probably not the right word for toilet stuff. Um, toilet cleaner because you know, you've got to keep the toilet clean. And to be honest, these probably both do. Oh, I don't know, I could get rid of one of these, couldn't I? 
I might just keep, oh, this doesn't kill bacteria. This just smells nice, this kills bacteria. Um, so I'm gonna keep both. I'm not a superwoman, I can't <laughs> get rid of everything. Um, and then this spray, which I just like to spray like all over the bathroom most nights before I go to bed, just because then I know I'm gonna wake up and everything will be anti backed Okay, so that's that cupboard all organized. So I've got all of the products in this little basket thing so I can take them out easily. And then the laundry stuff there and the hoover there. And then this is the stuff I'm getting rid of, not my phone or my lens. <laughs> this was just a basket that I had some of the cleaning stuff in, but being wicker, I just think it's gonna hold bacteria, so that's why I've swapped it for that plastic one. Um, so I'm just gonna chuck that. And then these um, laundry detergents I'm gonna give to my mum. We won't use them, and there's quite a few in there. Um, a sponge and a cloth, they've just been in there for a while, I don't know if they touch the toilet or what, so they'll go in the bin. That's just an empty packet. Like I said, these I'm gonna put in upstairs, downstairs toilets. Um, lime scale remover, I don't need, because I've said before, I'm very fortunate I have a cleaner that comes in once a week, so lime scale doesn't build up. Um, and Dettol spray, this is almost empty, so I might pour this into another one. But that's it, that's my utility room slash downstairs toilet room, don't really know what you'd call it, all done. So yeah, that's another one off the list. If you haven't seen the other videos in this series, I'll leave a link to the playlist in the description box below. And now I'm gonna do, I think, my hallway. Please stay tuned, give this a big fat thumbs up if you liked it, comment below if you've got any tips, any advice, and subscribe if you haven't already. Thanks for watching, guys, bye.